Yeah. Um, let's do zero to plex then, right? Um, zero to plex is funny because... Um, so, um, yeah, if you don't know what zero to plex is... Um, Zero to Plex uh, is a the the alpha challenge where I take a fresh um, alpha account uh, from complete zero to uh, being able to plex it um, by only station trading, so not doing anything else, um, and station trading in hard mode because I share all the profits uh, that I make on stream here and I sh I show everyone the items that I'm making the most money in, um, and also in alpha mode, alpha trading is quite painful, so. I do recommend if you want to have a real trading account uh, to go Omega as quickly as possible, you're going to make that much more money, I think, to make it worth it. But uh, if you don't want to do that, you can still make, uh, you can definitely make uh, a billion or two a month uh, just by trading on an alpha account for sure. And all of this with about 15 to 20 minutes a day. So I think um, it's a fun thing to do on the side. Uh, or get caught up uh, and do it full time like me. <laughs> okay, so this graph in the background is uh, an application called Chief Assets, um, and here you can see that um, we had a huge spike yesterday, and that's because I started trading in uh, uh, in uh, needlejack filaments uh, just before they started to explode. So we had quite a significant uh, increase here yesterday, from 750 million to 870 million. Uh, just uh, over the course of, course of uh, um, a few hours. Um, this has since dropped back down because prices have, have dropped again, but uh, we're still doing uh, quite well uh, at about 830 million now. If we uh, compare this across the uh, different trade hubs, you can see that uh, about 290 million of that is in uh, in, uh, in Jita. Um, 230 million is in uh, Amar and uh, 300 million is in Dodixie. So is this nice? So I have now officially made more money on this challenge in Dodixie than uh, than in Jita. That's nice. Um, the reason that that fluctuates quite a bit. Um, so first of all, the reason I, I picked those those three trade hubs is because. Um, those are the three biggest NPC trade hubs, right? So <clears throat> that's those are the the three uh, centers of the universe, so to speak, of the high sec universe. And um, in Jita, though, you have a huge trade volume, so a lot of items uh, are uh, you, there are a lot of ton of items that you can trade in that you can have margins in um, uh, that uh, will have the volume uh, for you to trade in um, and. For alpha for alpha trading, the the number of items is pretty much limitless because you you're looking for um, high vo high margin, but you don't need crazy volume. So uh, you know in Jira you can you can find thousands of items that you could trade in for an alpha challenge. So Dixie and Amara are much different because there's there's uh, eighty percent less volume. So, um, Chickenhead, what's up, dude? Donated blood, hell yeah, dude. Way to go, man. Um, so, um, do Dixie and Amar are different because the, there's there's much, 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 much less volume, but margins are bigger um, on, on a lot of those items because the, the market doesn't correct itself uh, as quickly as, uh, as Jita does. Uh, Jita is a very efficient market. Amar and Dodixi are very inefficient markets because there's not enough volume being traded. Not enough traders fixing prices and capitalizing on price differences and therefore making the prices go back uh, to the equilibrium that they um, that they should rest in. Um, what... What we are, uh, uh, what we have uh, seen here, uh, is 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 pretty much um, a fairly linear uh, increase, and now it's going a little bit uh, exponential. That's what we what we would be hoping hoping that uh, it would go. Uh, I'm still hopeful that um, you know we have what three days left uh, for the month, uh, one month uh, since we started the challenge. So possibly we'll still. Uh, reach or get close to uh, to a billion. So that'd, that'd be nice. Um, okay, so let's uh, let's look at the 
let's look at the trade sheet right here this is the um this is the amount of items uh, that i've traded in so so far in this challenge okay I've, I've traded in 81 items quite a lot a lot of these are i think though items that yeah that i initially sold that aren't really part of the challenge that are just coming from the korea version and um this this column right here is really important because that's the item uh, the profit per item column and there are some mainstays like gamma filaments are three of the top five gamma filaments obviously um uh, working for me really well there um you want to see fluctuations but you definitely want to see a, just an inherent margin in an item so filaments are really great for that you can see that I just started trading these two days ago and noise fives already uh generated 28 million though so that those that's just that recent spike that we saw we need to liquidate those quickly <laughs> uh quickly 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 um yeah so i've left this at the sort uh, in the in the order that they were by profit on monday so we can uh, have a look at what what spiked up so you can see signal 25s I wasn't trading in them before and now they spiked up because um, we um, we bought uh, we bought a few at 223 and then sold at two and a half million that's what that spiked it to the market nice um, is there anything down here not really this is all boring um, arbalest cruise launchers they recovered in price apparently oh no they haven't we've just made a lot of money they're still down there Okay, um, that's uh, that's because these are probably making less money now. The, the prices for exotic fil filaments have dropped. Um, yeah, other than that, one of the biggest uh, uh, earners is medium answer shield booster. That doesn't work everywhere either, though. Uh, I think overall the pattern. If you're if you're new to this and you're thinking, okay, what are the items I can the item ca categories I can look at to to trade as an alpha in, um, then uh then the hint that i can give you is low level filaments uh, low level popular filaments so you know gamma uh, exotic electric filaments uh tranquil calm agitated uh, fierce uh those the the tier zero to tier four uh, filaments or tier three filaments are are great uh as starter items uh, and then uh, the named modules um, uh, or, or sometimes called meta modules um, uh, or at least tier one modules. Uh, don't waste too much of your time on the alpha challenge on tier two modules or rigs because uh, what they will, uh, they're mostly manufactured and sold to sell orders. So they won't um, uh, typically won't have the big margins. Some of them might, you might be, get lucky, but typically they won't. um and yeah if you um you know if you uh i i'm definitely going to release uh, this data after the challenge is over but um you know if you're interested in uh, uh which which items uh these are uh, then you can definitely just uh, take a screenshot or you know hit me up i'll send you a copy or something um cool this is just for tracking profits though so you can if you add this up you can see i've made about 600 million in profits based on 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 this sheet um this already subtracts certain things that chief assets doesn't the uh, um for the alpha challenge it's not really that important whether it's a million here or a million there because it's more about the the whole learning the whole process um so actually um i'm going to log into the the challenge account right here in a second while i do that um it's it's clear i think we won't hit the up goal for the week today so what i'm going to do start a give So 
we're going to do a giveaway for one Aeon share worth 117 million. Uh, anyone can enter. Um... DJ, man, thank you for that tier one subscription. Appreciate that, man. Oh, yeah. You've been uh, you've been hanging out for quite a while, haven't you? Or are you a different CJ? Um, <laughs> yeah, our schedules don't line up, huh? Um, yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm trying to, uh, to, to stream in different time zones, but it doesn't, it doesn't work. I have a, a family and a job, and it's just difficult. Okay, we're gonna do a 15-minute giveaway, um, that is starting right now. Exclamation mark raffle to enter. Um, and uh, while you guys do that, uh, I just saw um, a couple of people follow. Um, do make sure you hit um, uh, you hit that follow button because I only stream uh, three nights a week for about two hours. So uh, it's, uh, it's rare to catch me uh, accidentally. So if you uh, wanna get notified, um, uh, when I go online, then I click that follow button. And also, there's a Discord uh, with about 800, maybe now 900 traders uh, and other fun people uh, that you can join. I just linked that in there. Oh, damn, man. DJ, dude. Thank you for that uh, tier one uh, subscription uh, gift to six people, man. Six people, look at that. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. And there's some, uh, some, some, some channel celebrities uh, winning those. Double D didn't have a tier one sub. How rich can you be, man? Double D. <laughs> with all your, with all your tier, tier two ship construction. And also two Paul, man. Um, thank you. Thank you, CJ. Really appreciate that, man. That means we'll do back-to-back -back giveaways. Can't buy subs with tier 2 ships? <laughs> no, you can't. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, I, I wanted to show you. I... Uh, I was I was premature in, uh, in logging in there. Um, let me log out again. No, I actually don't. Okay, so this is zero to plex. Um, as I said, one character in Jita, one in Dodixi, one in Amar, and um, this is the character that is actually in uh, um, in Jita. Um, and when I say Jita, it's not, it doesn't live in Jita, it lives in Perimeter because um, that is where you will always put your buy orders and as a as an alpha, you can't remotely uh, put buy orders in. So you have to actually be in Perimeter. That will also mean that you can update your buy orders once a day in Perimeter, which is good. And um, if you do at some point have to update your sell orders, you will just have to make that one jump to Jita and do that i recommend you do that um only when you have to um and a maximum like two 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 times a week or something like that um if we look at the the orders here we can see that most of this stuff has uh, fulfilled however uh we can also see that we only have about nine million in uh nine million in funds um so that's not that's not great uh, to invest in so what i'm gonna have to focus on is uh selling some stuff and we can see here that um, uh, when I when I put buy orders in perimeter, some of the uh, some of them actually get fulfilled in perimeter. Uh, so you can see here we have a few items. Uh, this would be small enough to fly over there in a Corvette. Though. That's what I meant earlier. With um, I typically just fly stuff over in a Corvette, um, but I do that once a, once a week or a couple of days or whenever I you know have have time to do that. What we're going to do now is 
thankfully as an alpha you can still remotely sell so you can actually click on your personal assets right here and look at um, GDA 44 and look at all the stuff that has amassed there over the past uh, a few days so what we can do is um, look at fierce gamma filaments and see where the price has gone and thankfully it has come back up uh, so I was sitting on a bunch of items that weren't increasing in price uh, uh, and while I typically don't buy and hold on an alpha challenge on an alpha challenge I want to just you know consistently get buy orders fulfilled immediately re, re, repost it as a sell order because I'm trying to capitalize on the margin um, this was a little bit of a buy and hold because it just wasn't recovering I was expecting it to go this but it just dropped down and then didn't recover. Um, we talked about gamma filaments earlier. Now I'm kind of fine at selling them at 3.8 million though. At 3.8, I'm kind of okay. So I'm um, probably gonna just post these at uh, 38.75. Which would be um, a huge sell order. Um, since I have a lot of open orders here, which is, uh, which is typically not the case, I'm only going to sell a ton of them. The reason I'm splitting them up is because, um, with the, with the, the changes that, that came in March, um, modifying sell orders is, is quite expensive. Um, and especially, uh, in Jita. <laughs> If you have sell orders out there uh, for for too much and they get outpriced, um, then you want to be able to sell to 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 modify them separately from each other, so that you don't always have to pay the full price to to change that um, that order. And so that's why I'm putting uh, half up here and uh, sitting on the other half. Agi agitated gammas uh, similarly. So it's interesting that agitated gammas and fierce gammas are moving very very similarly in. Uh, in, in this case, um, 574 though, okay, 586 in Jita though, not a fantastic price. If we look at what I've been buying at, uh, 438, 486, 580 isn't, isn't really great, uh, right? It's not great. Um, so I'm gonna hold on to those a little bit longer. Let's have a look at the torpedo launchers here. They've just been nose divings. Here, I don't even know if I'm gonna wait for them to come back up. Maybe I'll just sell and, and get out of there. Um, or take a loss though, probably. These prototype launchers, uh, I've bought them at 50, 80, 87. Let's see, we might just sit on them. Uh, or actually, I mean, let me see here. I'm trying to figure out the reason why these have tanked. Um, they they have a pretty steady volume, and they they must have dropped more than before because um, the volume increased, but the price decreased. So that's a lot of people dumping them on the market. So people don't. Are not using them anymore. I've been looting them uh, at increased rates. Well, CJ, I would think so, but this drop started, um, you know, it started a month ago, so it's it can't just be, um, can't just be the drop chance. It can't. But for a lot of things, that that made it worse, <laughs> for sure. Um, yeah, Joker, uh, take everything you can, everything you can, even the ships. I have, um, <laughs> if, uh, uh, one, one thing that I used to do a lot when I didn't have a lot of money, by the way, is I used to go into the starter systems and you can buy up all the destroyers and frigates that the starter people, uh, amass there because they, they're never going to be able to take them all out there. You can buy them all up. It's not going to make you rich in terms of now rich, but if you're just starting out, you can actually make it fair that way. Um, yeah. 
Same here. I'm guessing these guys are turning around, but uh, here... 220. Kind of a pity that I'm sitting on all these things. Okay, these guys, have they increased? No. So the tier tier one items right now is just um, it's it's just not uh, uh, not great price. It's a good time to enter the market. It's just not a good good time to uh, to be sitting on inventory. Um, these guys as well. I've been buying them at 340. Now they're at 400. Um, for for the alpha challenge, these are all terrible terrible margins. Except for the tranquil exotics, those those kind of work. Although they've also significant. Okay, so we we're gonna need uh, money eventually, right? So I'm just gonna um, I'm just gonna bite the bullet on these, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna sell some of this stuff, um, and then. Uh, the reason you can do that and not feel too bad about it is because um, you're gonna you, you're gonna have to keep the volume high on if you're trading on an alpha challenge and you want to just you know keep keep on trading. Your average margin is gonna be between fifty and a hundred percent. So losing money or or not making a great margin on one item is not gonna kill you as long as you're not. Uh, it doesn't slow you down too much um, because every time you uh, turn that money around and invest it into something else you're you're expecting to make another 50 percent so so you'll be fine um, on these as well no I, on these I'm very very sure they're turning around so there I am I'm banking on them. And here I'm gonna just sell a few of them. I'm gonna sell a few of them at uh, seven zero nine eight zero, and we're gonna just sell like fifty of them or something. Legs, man. The man himself. Welcome, uh, welcome back to the stream. And uh, thank you for that tier one subscription. Six month is uh, an incredible feat. Not a lot of people have done that. And uh, also, Plagues is the top sub gifter on the account, as you can see up there. Um, so really, really uh, appreciate that, Plagues. Thanks for the support. Okay, so this is kind of a depressing picture in Jita. <laughs> um, let's look at the orders. We have to update some orders right here um, to 42. This item, why am I investing in it? You know, typically difficult to sell, uh, easy to buy, um, but the margin is insane. Not a great item though. I'm gonna try it maybe another day or two and then get rid of it. Um, tranquil electrical filaments. We haven't been able to fulfill any of them. This is, this is a, a red flag, right? If you have an order like this that you put up, a, a day or two ago and none of them fulfilled that either you were really unlucky and somebody immediately outbid you like this dude did or these two did um or nobody is selling <laughs> this graph would indicate that yes people are buying more than they're selling but the average daily volume is around 400 so you would expect this to be moving I'm gonna let's see can we do 200 is 200 a good price it's okay i'm gonna try this one more time but if it doesn't work um then i'm gonna drop that item as well these have fulfilled really well so i'm gonna go to 181.1 Perfect. And now we have uh, just 5 million left, so there's really no point in putting a buy order in there. All you, all we can do is put sell orders in there, but I already established that I don't want to sell any of these. So. so 
Sorry, I have a cold if you haven't noticed by my very low voice. Um, I'm just not getting rid of this cold. And it's just not going to happen. Uh, it's just, it's it's staying in the family. It's, it, uh, fun fact, if you're trying to quarantine and somebody on the inside has a cold, uh, it doesn't work because you're just going to give each other the cold all the time. Um, okay, so that's, uh, that's Jida. Uh, let's go to let's go to a more exciting place. I already said earlier, Do Dixie is the place where we're making the money. Oh, by the way, exclamation mark raffle, guys! Exclamation mark raffle. Ten seconds. Ten seconds on the clock. Exclamation mark raffle. If you're not in there yet, exclamation mark raffle. Exclamation mark raffle. Nice. Oof. Barely made it in there. We're gonna have another back to back, thanks to um. Thanks to CJ, we're going to have another uh, raffle back-to-back. -back. So we're going to draw a winner right now, and then... Seth! That's awesome. Seth, very loyal viewer. You're in here all the time. I see you, I see you, man. I see you, and congrats. Congrats for winning that. That's one Aeon share worth 117 million. Uh... Seth, do ping me on Discord, um, please. Um, and we're going to complete that. And we're going to immediately start another one. We're going to immediately start another giveaway right here. It has started. So exclamation mark raffle if you want to enter uh, into this new one. Leo. Hey, man. I work with young children. Trust me. Don't even try to stay healthy if you have a three. Yeah, man. I mean... The thing is, it's like uh, my my kid's first year in uh, in uh, in in daycare, and so it's just there's there's no way there's no way getting around to. It. It's not even Corona, man. It's the Corona's not my it's not my problem. It's all the other bugs. Yeah, the new Gita four four plagues. Um, you joined a little late, but we did a tour earlier. <laughs> Uh, it's it's gorgeous. I absolutely love the new Gita 4.4. It's one of the best things CCP has done. I hope that they improve other trade hubs like that. That'd be really cool. I love it. It, it adds it adds a whole another layer. I think it's cosmetic, but it, it just adds another layer. So you can see here that you know in Amar I have 40 million, and in Dodixi I have 28 million. So in those in those areas, my 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 items are still moving because um, there's there's just higher margin items over there. Okay. Uh, this is a mar or or rather a shop. A shop is the um, um, the uh, citadel that you're doing your trading from uh, because it's uh, because you're trying to save taxes. One jump from a mar. It's the equivalent to perimeter. Um, and uh, what we're going to do here is where we, we definitely, we already already know that we have 48 million or 47 million is uh, here. So we're going to put some buy orders in. But, we, but before we do that, we're going to update the current buy order. So we're going to have a look here. Fierce gamma filaments. Jesus, there's a lot of people in here. There's a lot of people trying to buy these. Uh, but I'm still gonna try Trading Halcyons. These aren't working very well either because the competition is uh, is fierce Let's try this Thanks Dude, thank you for uh, for gifting those um, those subs man really appreciate that Thank you, man You like multiples of five? <laughs> So, uh, thank you, thank you, Blakes, uh, for that support, and uh, Unpiled Acorn and Trouble Trave, uh, congrats on winning those, uh, those gifted subs by Plagues. Um, yeah, so, this another, another one of those, those red flags, hey, uh, 47 out of 50, uh, you know, it's, it's been kind of a while. So um, I'm going to keep an eye on that. Maybe get out of that item. 
tranquil electrical filament we at least had 41 uh, 9 out of the 50 fulfilled um we'll try to uh, up that um and noise fives so this is where i got in uh, <laughs> this is where i got into the action and uh um Obviously, other people are outbidding me for uh, uh, for noise five needle jacks now because these these are the new hotness right now and they're selling for for two million. Um, so that's okay. I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna go to three hundred. Let's see here. Nope. I'm not gonna go along because I expect it to drop back down. But uh, possibly we have maybe we have some for sale. I don't. I don't think we do. But no, we don't. But you know, we profited it from it while it uh, while it lasted, so that's good. At least in the Dixie, we did. Um, so yeah, that's about uh, that's about it. Um, uh, we still now have uh, forty million to invest. Um, actually, let me see. Uh, we have five open orders, so I'm gonna see if I can sell something in Amar here. Um, fierce exotic filaments at three point three million. 3.3 .3 is there. Um, <clears throat> I've been buying them at 2.3. So I like that. Uh, I'm going to sell them. We're going to put these up for um, 3368. Uh, no, 3365. So what I'm what I'm just doing here is I'm, I'm 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 undercutting the next guy with a with a big order, right? Um. Uh, trouble trafe. Oh seven man. Um. Pierce gammas over here. Um. The thing is over here I'm buying them cheaply. I'm buying them at one point five. Um. So if I'm selling them, that's a, that's actually a pretty good um you know, margin right here. But. Overall, I don't think it's a good price. <laughs> so overall, I think I'm going to hold on to them and I'm waiting for the price to increase. Agitated gammas here also, the price is way too low. Prototype Arbel's Torpedo Launcher. This is also not working right now they've dropped in price a lot we're seeing a lot of the same a lot of the same movements here as we're seeing in Jita. of the electricals they're doing well they're doing really well right now we'll sell those three five nine nine And that's really all we can uh, sell right now. All the other stuff is really, really small, small time stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to invest in some new items. We have 45 million left and three orders. Let's let's involve that. Let's invest 15 million in, in three items uh, in Amar. My voice is slowly leaving me, so um, <clears throat> we're gonna get through through these ten minutes, and then, and then I'm gonna be done for. So what we're our mission is find three items to invest on the Alpha Challenge in Amar. So go. I'm gonna use three different approaches to finding a new item. Approach number one. I'm gonna go to my wallet, and. <clears throat> I'm going to sort by biggest sales. Why? Because this is a good indicator of people buying shit for me and I, me getting, me making deals. So fierce exotic filaments. Let me see here. People are buying this from me. This is a great margin between two and three million. It's it's moving multiple times. Um, competition is limited done 
Uh, and I wanted to invest 15 million in each of these. So we're gonna buy, let's see, we're gonna just buy five of these. Two, three, four, two. In a shop, let's do this. Dodo Power, man, thank you for that Prime subscription. Really appreciate it, man. Dodo Power, love the name. Um. So that was, that was uh, way number one to find an item, right? Number one was go to your wallet, uh, you sort it by uh, your sales to look at what have people actually been buying from you and then buy that. 07 Dodo Power. You can use the cool 07 now <laughs> with your subscription. Um, yeah. Uh, item uh, way number two <clears throat> way number two uh, oh yeah five minutes left on the on the raffle by the way guys uh, way number two is that you can go in here in your in your trade sheet by the way this sheet that I'm using in the background if you're wondering um, uh, whether this is my proprietary sheet um, it is but you can use it <laughs> Uh, here's the link. You can just download it. Um, there's a video on how to set it up as well. So um, feel free to just do that. Um, and so this sheet indicates uh, the top most profitable um, items. And so something that I like to do is just copying these over um, and replacing my quick bar in here with uh, these items which we already had in there, but I'm just showing it so that you can re replicate it at home. Uh, and then I'm, I'm clicking through these items to see what the, um, uh, what, what item has good margins and good volumes. Um, so, uh, you know, a shop, um, uh, a shop, uh, 100 MN monopropellant and during afterburners, uh, not a bad, not a bad margin right now, right here. Not a good distribution though. People are only buying this. They're not selling it uh, or, or selling it to buy orders. They're not buying it from sell orders. So this is actually a problem. So I'm not in a mar. I can't deal with these. Same here. You want these dots to be spread out in the channel. You don't want them to be on the edges. So I'm just clicking through here. Um, this isn't good. This isn't good. We don't want any any of that stuff. Agitated gamma, possibly, because you can buy it cheaply now. the 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 sell price has tanked of the on these, but you can buy them quite cheaply right now. Possibly, I'm I'm intrigued. Ooh, fat finger. Uh, for three five one eight. Are we buying this fat finger? I know it's not a fat finger. We discussed that last time. This erroneously placed order. Are we buying this for 3.5? I think so. Do it. That took one item away, but... Uh, I had to buy it. Somebody put a, a sell order at, at the buy price. Um, these also work. These have a 50% margin. So you can see here from 105 to 151. Uh, this is a 50% margin, not bad, on a nice volume and a good spread. So these also work still well. Ooh, these work, these work because the price has basically exploded. Uh, if you, if you can get some buy orders fulfilled, these are nice. Fabricio, dude. Oh yeah, man. Welcome back to the stream. Haven't seen you in a while. Um... So these, yes, no volume at all. <laughs> nope. These were already in. These were already in the market. Um, this is a about a 30-40% margin. Ooh. What did just somebody just buy from me? Drone tactical limbs. Nice. Okay. These might actually be a good item again. Okay. So I, I used to say that you, you can't trade uh, drone items in, in Amar, but maybe you can. Um, yeah, I get it, Fabrizio, man. My, my, my month was crazy as well. 
but I've I've taken a liking in in, in trading drone tactical limbs in Amar because the margin is crazy. You can see that here, right? Like I'm buying at 60 and selling at 39. I used to be selling at 21, but still, like th this, it's moving now. It's moving now. This is this is just the past week that we're looking at here. Um, might be might be something here if we're if we're making sales here now. Um, so I might put another buy order in, in here for drone tactical limbs. Uh, let's see. Can we buy 500? Yeah, we'll buy fi another 500 at 16, 630. And then, um, the, uh, the last, um, way that you can, uh, you can use to identify good items is, uh, simply, oh, let me look at the. Okay, there's 47 seconds left on the uh, uh, on the giveaway. So, exclamation mark raffle if you want to enter the giveaway. Fabrizio sliding in there. Seth. Honestly, dude. <laughs> I mean, in your shoes, I'd try again as well, right? But uh, I, ho I hope we spread we spread the love a little bit. Um, so the third way. <laughs> no, I mean fair. It's fair and square. If you win it, you get it. Um, the the third way we're gonna we're gonna be able to uh, uh, identify an item is uh, by going through uh, Adam for Eve. So in Adam for Eve. Um, you can uh, what you can do is you can put uh, you can click here on the on the margin finder um, and uh, so apologies to those of you that hang out here all the time and know this um, uh, you can uh, put domain right there oh did that work uh, you can put domain there and uh, for example modules uh, right there and uh, then what you will see is you will see the items with the with the largest margins that fit your criteria so in this case over 100 million traded i don't really need over 100 million traded the reason i put 50 million there is because if you assume that i'm investing 200 million um in 10 items that's 20 million per item right um if you assume that uh there's even buy and sell uh, distribution then at 50 million we would have 25 million on the buy side and 25 million on the sell side that's why i'm putting uh the the minimum trade is get 50 million and so minimum trades 24 just means one trade per hour i like to have this bigger so let's 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 check if we have this at 50 if we still get some good items um and then we can go down the list and see if we can find a good item um this one keeps coming up, the capacitor booster, but it's just, it's too cheap. I've checked it a few times. Um, I, 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 as I said before, I ignore rigs and I ignore tier 2 items just to make it simple because most of the time they don't work really well. Again, the fleeting compact stasis webifier, it gets, it gets recommended all the time. Let's, let's have a look if, if, if that item works in Amar. No, it doesn't. It's, um, I mean, definitely buy this fat finger right here. <laughs> I mean, it's not a bad item, right? The distribution is not bad. It's increasing in price right now. If somebody bought out uh, a whole bunch of them, you can make a 50% margin. It's just... I don't I don't like items like this because there's a there's a spike uh, items that work because there's a spike are not sustainable so back to the drawing board sisters core probe launcher this is a uh, way crazy prices uh, I'm, I'm I I can't invest that much obviously yeah I hate 50% margin on something that cheap exactly Seth. absolutely Halcyon core equal already already trading in it. 
What's this heavy jiggero? Hello, jiggero. What's this guy? Is he any good? Hell no. So, this is a bad item because this is people only selling this to buy orders. Nobody buys this from sell orders. So, if you want to buy and sell this on the market, good luck. You're never going to get it. Get it. Um, okay. So, this we're getting too, too low. So, obviously, we're going to have to drop the... <clears throat> trade for our trade per hour requirement if we do that um do we get anything good not really prototype torpedo launcher i think we were already talked about that one yeah the grappler will be <laughs> reprocessed food absolutely <laughs> So this, I'm, I've been trying to sell forever. This is no good, huh? I mean, now the price is low. I get it. But still, I, I haven't, I haven't had great success with it. So what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna, we're gonna look at a different, um, we're gonna look at a different um, category. So let's look at something like commodities. Calm exotic filaments. Are you kidding me? Really? What are they doing? 250? 250? I mean... Three people fighting over them though. I'm gonna just try this just for shits and giggles. What if I buy... Uh, I would have to buy I would have to buy too many of them to it's not gonna work it's not gonna work Tuttle what's up dude that is always my probably or nearly I try to lower account for item per hour and always with good margin only a tier 2 or rigs which we said to avoid yeah um signal five needle jacks maybe they still work here <laughs> this is nice. Said we wouldn't. 300 is not crazy dumb. Are people still selling this though? Are people still selling this to buy orders? Competition is too big. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. There's, we, we talked about that at the beginning of the stream, CJ. Uh, they, they absolutely exploded. Yeah. Here's Gammas. I'm already in. Oh, Republic Fleet High Captain Insignias. I love them. Those that That's my staple on the Aeon Fund. Can't we do this? Look at this. Oh, I love it. Let's try to get some of those. Awesome. I mean, you guys are gonna, like, outbid me like crazy. But we're gonna do this anyway. Boom. Alright, that's that. Oh, sorry. You guys couldn't see that. I put a buy order in here for Republic Fleet High Cap. This is a fucking, this is a, this is a great, great situation right here. We love it. Um, you, you might not be able to sell them there, um, but you can sell those anywhere. So I can never resist tags, right? Okay. Oh yeah, commodity are nice. Commodity is a nice type, man. Type category commodity is 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 my thing. That's that's where I, this is where I hang out. The type category commodity is where I, I hang out. Come join me. Good good trades to be made. Because they combine filaments and data cores and insignias. That's like the that's that's the trifecta of amazingness. All right, who wants to win? Who wants to win? Let's see. Um, 38 people entered the raffle. And the winner is... Hebus. Congrats, man. Are you there? Hebus wins a 
17 million Aeon share. He was... I mean, he's a regular, so he'll be there. If not, somebody poke him. <laughs> no matches in chat? Ah. Okay. Too bad, Hebus. I love you anyway. We'll pick another winner. I, I, I just believe you guys. Well, I have bonsai. Bonsai is. Uh, if bonsai says so, then I gotta believe it. Uh, we'll pick another winner or, or Hebus. Three, two. Say something in chat. One. Here we go. Redraw. Rubax, are you there? <laughs> got a, yeah, I've got a re-roll emoji. That's nice, dude. Rubax, yoo-hoo. Herzlichen Glückwunsch, Digga. All right. Um, Rubax, hit me up on uh, on Discord. So that I can uh, buy that share on your behalf. Give me your in-game name. Uh, here's the link to the Discord. Um, guys, I, I remember there was one thing that somebody asked. Um, uh, all don't forget, if you had lots of triangle skill books or slowly sell, they are now back in the Abyssal Death Space. Surprise so about to tank. Yeah. So price jumped up a few days ago on the Abyssal skill books and. Uh, it's about to tank again for sure. Um, somebody asked how you can identify the 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 orders that I call fat fingers that are not fat fingers, but that that are sell orders posted as buy orders. How can you identify them? And I actually in my in my trade sheet, I have a an easy way of 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 doing exactly that. Um. um but it's not in the regular template but just so um just so to, just to give you some inspiration if you're trying to look for a way to find those fat finger items that somebody may have missed uh, you can just make an item that compares the jita sell price to the jita buy price or we have the forge buy price in here but you you already have the jita buy price down here in the in the low jita tab so if you make a column that sub subtracts one of, from the other and is close to zero, sort by that and just make a long list of items that you trade in, then that's your best way of identifying um, those fat finger items. I actually have that in my other sheet. I wonder, I can't, sh I can't show that right there because it's got my, got my completely private items in it, so I can't show it, but you, get, you guys get the point, right? If you don't, hit me up on Discord and ask me. It's, it's quite easy. <laughs> yeah, Digger in Germany. <laughs> Digger is is a, a a term of endearment in German for sure. Yeah, if the margin is point one percent, it's a fat finger. Yeah, it's a fat finger by by the by my definition. Yeah. Um. Okay. So. Um. Let me uh, let me slowly wrap up wrap up by saying hey um, you guys really pulled it out with the uh, with the subs today thank you thank you plagues and CJ specifically for for um, gifting all those subs thank thank you guys that's um, that's fantastic um, thanks for that support um, if you guys are, are are lost or need to start uh, earlier than what we did today uh, make sure you check out my YouTube channel at, at slash Oz Eve and what you can do there is um, uh, you can uh, uh, you can watch uh, guides on not only the, the early episodes on the Zero Duplex, but you can also watch guides on just basic the identification of items in Adam for Eve in more detail, just like I did right now. Um, uh, you know, specifically alpha trading guides. Um, they're all out there. Go check them out. Um, and um, 
also what I, what I didn't show last time um, is I, I haven't found a good place to, sh to host this right um, but I um, I can't stress this enough this uh, trading cheat sheet is out there right so if you if you if you don't know where to start and you don't want a video or anything you just want something in your hand then check out this this cheat sheet because it has um, a lot of the information that I keep on saying here in one place um, so um, make sure you check that out it's on the discord so I'll, I'll link the discord again it's on the discord and the FAQs it's on Twitter it's on reddit so you should be able to find it but um, here it is 